You're watching Suck Professor. Hello, everybody. It's me, Hank. Welcome to the channel Fallout 4, episode 38, I believe. Thank you for finding our channel and clicking play. Let's get to it. Fallout 4, here we go. Me and my buddy, Paladin Ted Danson, are moving in. We need to fix their radio thing or something or other, and he's recruited me. I've got a pretty blue dress. Um, you know, I, I've given it a lot of thought, and I've decided it turns out it's a sexy dress after all. I lost my red dress through, from a recording error, had to reload and it's no longer there, but I've got the blue one. And the reason I think it's sexy is because they're, because I'm not wearing any panties underneath it. And that's always uh, like the greatest thing a man can hear for some reason, because we're fucking creeps. Okay, cool, let's get to it. Uh, first, as fun as it is to have the gentle radiated wind blowing upon my recently coiffured Vagina, I'm gonna put on some some gear here so I don't get fucked up. All right, leather leg, leather leg. I've got some new stuff here. Champion left arm, always. That's a pretty good one. Boiled leather right arm. I think I don't think I need that one. I'm getting a little confused. Pocketed. That's right. Oh yeah, pocketed, hardened. Okay, this is the one I was wearing. Gets me up to 275. Um, pocketed, hardened, raider right leg. What do I have on the right leg? Leather right leg, 611, pocketed, 280. Uh, I think it's probably worth it. Although maybe I'll just save it in case I get full. And uh, I, could do, I could do some crafting. Hopefully I can combine some of those mods and stuff. So one last thing before we move it on. I need to get back in to my... I gotta get rid of some of this radiation. Oh, and I found another carrot, which is exciting. Oh, oh god, that's the whole most horrifying carrot I've ever seen in my life. Look at that. That looks like a... Looks like some kind of stabby weapon. Or a... Okay, I was going to say something about dildos and clitorises and stuff. Alright, uh... Exit. Um... Hmm... Where... Ooh, I didn't mean to hit that. Speaking of dildos... <laughs> okay. Alright. <laughs> um... <laughs> sort! Alright, Z. Alright, good. Insta mash. No, I want rad away. I am so sick of this goddamn menu system. When will the modders fix it? It's kind of shitty that you have to depend on the people who didn't make the game to make it better. And I'm not asking for revolution. I just wanted to s categorize things so I can scroll up and down to them easily. There it is, right away. So I'm way high. I could probably take two, but I'm only going to take one. And now I need to heal, I think, one of my quick menu items, which would be the F button, is Grilled Rad Roach. There you go, it healed me up. Good as new, not really. All right, dude, let's move it in here. I'm ready. I will go with this of course like everything I want to stop in and look for stuff and take everything I can get my grubby hands on mongo dog meat fuck yes hey if you guys are uh, enjoying this playthrough like and subscribe hit that like button if you like it that helps uh, YouTube sees that activity and goes hey people are liking this asshole let's let's help them find some more assholes and listen up we do oh. this clean and quiet no heroics and buy the book of Understood. course why are we at Arcjet again? Understood. This isn't my first rodeo. <laughs> I forgot I to put on clothes. <laughs> I'm simply offering valuable uh. tactical advice. You'd do well to listen. Remember, our primary target is the deep range transmitter. Stay focused and check your fire. I don't want to be hit by stray bullets. Do you think I should put on clothes? Do you like the way my nipples look in the sunlight? All right, before we do that, let's let's get geared up here. Can't keep being so silly. Longshoreman outfit. Has energy resistance. Now that's pretty sweet. Alright. What am I missing? Okay. Do I have that chest? Okay, so I have the fatigues, the chest piece, and now I just need to check the legs. I got four. Right leg, left leg. Good. Right arm. Left arm. That's my champion, right? Yeah, champion left arm. Fuck yeah. All right, 55 damage resist, 54 energy resist. That feels pretty good. 
All right, buddy, coming after you. I'll be your Diane. If you promise to leave Kirstie Alley out of it. I'm referencing 80s TV shows. Oh, wow, here we go. Wow, so much junk to collect. Tube flange. Gear. It's probably good stuff. It was corporations like this that put the last nail in the coffin for mankind. I was just going to say that. They exploited technology for their own gains, pocketing the cash and ignoring the damage they've done. That's kind of what corporations do, though, dude. They exploit resources, privatize the profits as best as the laws allow them in the various countries in which they operate, which is usually all of them. And they socialize the expenses like pollution and pollution cleanup and workers. Oh boy. Hey now, we got a robot farm. Look at these wrecks. It appears as though the facility's automated security has already been dealt with. Is this, the is this the Brotherhood of Steel's handiwork? Unfortunately, no. Look at the evidence. There isn't a single spent ammunition casing or drop of blood in sight. These robots were assaulted by Institute Synths. What? My first hearing about synths other than in the trailers. Synth? Isn't that the same as robots? Does that stand for Cynthia? Technology created by the Institute. Abominations meant to improve upon humanity. Oh, it's boy. unacceptable. They simply can't be allowed to exist. Was he a racist? A synthist? Or does he care about synths and therefore is a synthesizer? Get it? He has sympathy for their pl plight. It sounds like you're scared of synths. Fuck face. There's a measurable difference between being frightened and being prepared. Now... Ah, Let's good point. Out. That's why I always answer the door on Halloween with a gun. Okay, so there's obviously going to be a lot of shit to do in this room. Office desk. That looks like a cooler. Is it? No, it's not. Oh, man. So these are protectorons? Yes, they are w whacked out. Oh, we got a circuit board here. These are good, I think. I'm pretty sure. I know, I've only found one so far. This place is Quit talking, you piece of shit. Okay, take some of this stuff. Mess, but I still see a few pieces of salvage that the Brotherhood might be interested in. Yeah, After we're done here, me too. We'll have to mark this place for sweep and retrieve. I was just thinking that. Sweep and retrieve, you know? I'd like to take it. I'd like to do arrive and retrieve, but instead we have to do arrive, mission, go back, then sweep it up and retrieve it, and then go home and have a snack. All right. Arcnet mail engines. So, from Thomas to so Oscar, I'd like to have your team get together and implement a new security strategy for the Arcjet complex as a first contract for the USSA. And I don't intend to have any security slip-ups while we're working on the XMB moves. And I want to double the coverage bush 24 hours a day, and install automated countermeasures inside the facility. I'd also like you to hire a consultant to figure out a better security password system for our terminals. The automated reset timer mailing our passwords is ridiculous. Thanks, pal. Turrets. Starting tomorrow, we'll begin distributing identification badges to all employees. These badges will be worn all times here. Infused with a low yield radioactive isotope that will prevent our internal security tourists from accidentally <laughs> shooting any of our own employees. If anyone is caught near the entrance to the engine core without a badge, we are not liable for injuries you may sustain. These tourists will go online in one week. So I suggest you. So if you just go to work and you're a little hungover and you don't have your badge and you get blown up by a turret, like, eh, not our fault. Thomas Reinhardt, CEO. Sam, what the hell is going on down there? How did a member of the press get all the way past security, through the entire research facility, and into the engine core without tripping our alarms or turrets? We have a real mess on our hands, and it's going to be your job to clean it up. Your job. I don't care how you do it, just make it all go away. Go away. If this comes back to bite us, I swear, I swear, you're going to be one of the, be the one that takes the fall. Takes the fall. He's angry. Let's see what this one does. Error. Uh-oh. Um, <laughs> personality mode. I like it. I, I think medical. I feel like that's safer. Now let's see what happens when I activate it. This is probably dumb. 
Activate. Uh huh. Which pods are we do talking about here? One of these, I assume. I mean, it makes sense that it would be for these, but also the game might be thinking like, well, later on, we'll get surprised. Alright, slow down there, Ted Danza, would you? I'm just doing some shit. Pow! Oh, yeah, hold on. Oh, yeah, let's just take a leak here. Oh. Here, I got some, I got some liquid. Oh, fuck yeah. It's one of those peas where you don't even touch your dick. The pressure from the stream just holds it in the right position. Like when a fire hose gets loose. Except it doesn't wiggle around, because it's a little dick. Ah, whoosh. Dish rag. Use that to dab the tip of my wee wee. Do you guys, what do you guys, let me know in the comments. Do you shake the, the drop off your dick, or you just let it go? Why did I take that? Or you just let it go into your underwear? You know? So it all depends on how I'm feeling at the time. Sometimes I don't give a shit. Other times, when I shake my dick, it causes a small earthquake. And uh, that's just rude. Boy, this place is a mess, isn't it? Looking, looking for stuff to snag. Bunch of old IBM PC juniors. Looks like a dead end. See if you can find a way to get that door open. I'm gonna reconnoiter the area. Okay, you reconnoiter. Piece of shit. I kinda wanna kill this guy. Be kind of just a fun way to just lure him into a dungeon and then murder him. Lab anal analysts terminal. Whoa. Why do we have water jugs made out of the guy from Terminator 2? Lab control terminal. Ah, um, oh, this really makes me wish I'd taken that. Uh, um, upped my stat, my perk. What's my next level eight? Okay, I got a little ways to go there. I mean, maybe I can do Hacking, this is beyond me. Fuck. Perhaps I can find the answer in here. Password security. Automated. Ah, okay. Password security. This is your annual reminder that all terminal and mainframe passwords are to be changed on a monthly basis. Failure to do so may result in automated changes. The suspension of network privileges and or disciplinary action. Please do your part in keeping ArcJet, ArcJet systems secure. Nice. For security purposes, your password will not be reset. 9YB3N. I'm going to guess I don't have to remember that. Plus, I'm recording video for YouTube, so if I do, it's there. Maybe that'll work on here now. Unlock! Yes. Yes! Oh, he typed it. Yeah, yeah. With the word one at the end. The word one? The, the number. Lab controls. Unable to... Okay, we don't have a prototype. I didn't do what I was supposed to. Here we go. I'm going to open the door for you there, Ted Danson. You ready? Okay. Open door. Of course. Beautiful. Busy. All right. Nice work. Let's get moving. Ah, shit. Ah, crap. I'm getting shot. I, I got guys here. Whoa, he's, he's a melee. Oh, what the hell, too? What? Oh, look at, look at the guy flying in the back. Holy shit. Is his head... Look Okay. Oh man, this is crazy. I didn't know this shit was gonna go down. Oh, he's telling me. Fuck the rest of you. Oh crap, this gun is actually decent. Oh, uh, you know what I'm gonna do? Shotgun. Where's my shotgun? No, no, no. Okay, we're clear. Oh crap, that went fast. Damn. Slow down, dude. So are synths gonna be evil? I hope they're gonna be evil. Maybe they're, they're misunderstood. Prostitute pistol. Oh, look at that face. No, not that gun. This is this is the menu. Oh, I see what I'm doing. Ah, sorry. Bear with me here. F. Where's my shotgun? It's number six. It's really hard to reach those buttons. <laughs> ah, yes. That's what I look like when I eat right. All right, I'm definitely going to check out their weapons here. This guy came at me with a baton. Oh, a shock baton. Can I pick him up? Yes. <laughs> Let's get a look at this. 
There you go. It's kind of cool. I like that kind of outer frame, and then they have this sort of skin layer, but they also have this internal structural stuff. Come on, get up. Oh, sorry. Oh, bonk in your head. Here, I'm gonna sit you up like a little boy on a on a park bench on a gazebo railing. Well, no, that's actually it's unfortunate when you do that when you sit a ch set a child down and that's how they <laughs> that's how they end up. Damn, man. Oh, okay. Oh, these are their pistols. Look, free back scratcher, Ted dancing. I got a back scratcher. Where'd it go? I don't think we're alone. Oh, really? What gave you that idea? Oh shit, he's fighting. Fuck. Oh shit. Well, I'm not gonna do it anyway. Oh fuck, I'm hurt. Ah. Uh, I didn't handle that well. Okay, that was stupid. I'm an idiot. <sighs> stupid Ted Danson. Alright, buddy. We have another fight. At least it saved it right here. Thank too fucking Christ. <laughs> uh, Alright. What if Jesus' name was Jesus F. Christ and the F stood for fucking? Because he liked to get his dick in. Dick wet. I should have said dick wet. That would have been better. It would have been more current. All right, password just changed. 9YB3N. Hell yeah. All right, I'm not gonna do it quite yet. I'm gonna move stuff around the room. So these guys all trip in a hilarious manner. Can I not pick up boxes? Can I pick up that thing? All right, I'm, a, I'm an apocalypse survivor, but I can't pick up boxes. Can I pick up chairs? No. Computers? No. Ugh. Come on. Do you understand what I'm trying to do here? I'm trying to keep us alive. All right. Well, this will have to do. Okay. Okay, guys, keep an eye on that. Let's see what happens. I'm pretty sure they're all going to trip over it and they're going to hilariously stumble into a big pile. And then as they're laughing about their fun misfortune, I'm going to shoot them all in the face. Meanwhile, what are my, what's my, you know what, maybe I should switch weapons. Oh, I don't have, oh, I have a laser rifle. Does this do more damage against them or less? I still think my shotgun, man. I think, I think it's nice to shoot these fucks in the face with some classic old buckshot. All right. Unlock. Oh yeah, I gotta go in there. Come on. All right, we're doing it. Over there! Over there! Hello, they're in there doing something. You must be destroyed. Hey, they tripped over the box. It didn't work. Shoot this guy in the face. Shoot him in the fucking face. Oh, I had to reload? Motherfucker. Boom! I didn't do anything! I did nothing! <laughs> oh, Jesus. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Paladin dancing is doing it. I'm hurt. I'm hurt bad. Fortunately, I have some rad roach meat to heal my, my wounded bones. How much will it do? Not enough. More! Yeah, I should do one more. Alright. Ah, it's fucking crazy. Okay, let's gear up a little more for this next battle. I'm not gonna go forward until I'm ready. Um, oh! I turned him into this thing. You may have a problem here. Oh, you think? Ah, he's already fighting! Fuck! Leg actuator damage. Come on, get out the pistol. Does that even do anything? I don't think it's doing anything. I think I need to get the, an energy weapon. Fuck. 
fuck, 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 fuck. Okay. I don't know. I honestly am just guessing here about this. That this is. They caused fires? It's not safe. Alright, I think it did a little damage. Oh, I got one. That guy is in unstoppable up there. Uh, Ted Danson's getting all the goddamn XP. Alright, bitch. Slow down. Would you just calm the fuck down? We're not all wearing uh, a medieval castle around our bones. Now, does he have like a health he has to worry about? Oh, circuit board. Yeah. Uh, oh, it's crazy. It's like a intestinal system, too. Oh, wait. It's kind of funny. Oh, look ahead. Always clean up. See? Stayed right where I put it. I like how they have uh, the vague outline of a chode or a taint if you're from a poor family. Unlike a sophisticated people who call it what it really is. The bridge from your butt to your genitals. Is a butt a genital? No, it's not. You know, it's not. Genital stands for genetic reproduction at all. And therefore, it is not a genital. I mean, it is. A butt does not required for genital re for reproduction, but it is required for arousal. So in a way, it's basically like the fluffer of the sex act, assuming you're a butt man like me and have a terrific butt like I do. Oh, <laughs> that's my guy. I'm st stealing toys here, Ted. I like how it's like the super sophisticated arc jet facility, but they still nice. have locks that can be done with an undone with a bobby pin and a screwdriver. Boy, there's just tons of loot here. I want it all. So these guys are tough. There you go. Stealth boy, fuck yeah, those are a thing, right? Oh fuck, he's fighting. Fuck, 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 get out of there. What's going on? Stop, just... Oh, fuck. Piece of shit. <laughs> That's how we do it in the Brotherhood. That's what he says when he comes. He's just really going at it here, isn't he? Maybe there's a computer terminal I can use to turn it off, you fucking asshole. Ah. You're welcome. Over there. Over there. Okay. You stay here. Stop wandering around. I'm looking around for stuff, okay? I'm having a smoke. Ah, yes. Murdering. Humanoid robots after waking up 200 years with a dead baby and a dead wife is what it's all about Correction possibly dead baby probably a grown man or something and more than likely gonna be a character in the game uh. By the way if you're a smoker, why don't you go kill yourself you fucking litterer all right be, be one of those smokers you might you don't have to care about your body But don't throw the fucking cigarette butts on the ground or out your car window like a goddamn animal. What's wrong with you? Yeah, you know what? You know, I understand. I get it. I get it. I understand. You have a problem when you're smoking and when you're done. The problem is you're holding garbage, right? That's your problem. And it's a disgusting thing with your lip grease on it and it's got your lipstick or your fucking bullshit. It's gross and you don't want to hold it. I don't blame you. You shouldn't have to hold it. And guess what? No one wants to hold it. And that's, but the thing is, it's your fucking choice. You decided to smoke. You dispose of your fucking cigarette butt properly. Don't toss it on the ground for somebody else to do. Deal with it. Put it in a bag. It's still going to exist. It's still going to be a disgusting thing in the world. But it doesn't need to be tossed into public spaces for other people to deal with. It's not a complicated notion. Never been... Not angered when I see a car. Oh, got mines here. 
when I'm behind a car and the, f you know, a little sparkly cigarette comes flying out of the, out of the window. Can I turn this off? Yeah. Fiber optics. Oh, you don't get the alarm, but you get stuff out of it. Okay. I don't I just think it's a really shady thing to do to the world. It's bad enough that you're fucking up your body. I don't care. Go ahead, man. Free country and all that. Just Tesla arc. Hey, all right. Just uh, leave the rest of us out of it is all I'm saying. So good. Probably just pissed off half the half the viewers. <laughs> why, why, why half? Got a living computer here, guys. That's probably where I could have turned off those turrets. Oh, yeah. Well, it just so happens I happen to be a novice unlocker. Oh, that was so close. Bullshit. Yeah, there it is. Got it. Got it. Oh, I was like, holy crap, look at all this stuff. <laughs> uh huh. Oh, man. Steel. I got enough steel. So I do want to. Oh, expert. Mock tight. Fuck, now if I had not done that night vision thing, I could have done that one. Can't break the code. Or the other computer thing. Ugh, I have so many safes I want to go back to, but I don't remember where any of them are. Getting lots of pistols. Oh, that was supposed to be like a really acrobatic jump. Oh, why am I walking? What the hell? Oh, am I over encumbered? Did it finally happen? Yes, it did. Not. However, if I change to a pocketed pants, just like that, I'm not over encumbered. But you know what I haven't even done yet? I haven't looked at their weapons. Let's get a look at these Institute pistols. So I don't need to hold on to this thing. 3.9, they weigh a good bit. So this is 4 times so 16 weight right there. Let's inspect it. Okay. Very neat. Kind of a little bit of a Star Trek thing going on. A little, uh battered. Looks like a stormtrooper's dick. Exit. Are they tough? 15 electrical damage. Oh, I know. Hold on. A bunch of crafting tables. I forgot about that. Why am I... There it is. Press B. B again. Okay. Chemistry. What else was there? I saw another one, didn't I? Yes. No? Yes? Chemistry. All right. Well, I'm gonna transfer junk. Store all junk. Oh, there's probably stuff here I shouldn't store. Because more than likely I'll forget to come back. You know what? I am gonna come back for sure. Oh crap! What did I just store? I just did something. Um. Because how can I not come back? I haven't taken, there's so much more to loot out of this one. So store, 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 keep one, store this guy. Piss tech hard. <laughs> Scoped Institute rifle. That might be worth hanging out with. I don't know if the shotgun's doing me much good. Short pipe rifle. Whoa, 17 and, does it do both at the same time? Or one of the, you know, how does that work? But I believe that it's probably pretty good. Can I rename? No. Get rid of the machete. 22 versus 17.5. Mm. I still don't know. Shock baton, short double barrel. All right, I'll get rid of the de the dresses as much as I. Lightweight shadowed. That's actually a good one. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Studded leather right leg. Why does that not? Oh, because I have the pocketed one on. Okay. Six and 11. Pocketed right, right leg. Five and five. But it's got a pocket. Get rid of that. You shank a hat. Wow, what does that look like? Is that like a weird Eskimo thing? Get rid of those. Clean blue suit. Waist three. It's too much. Boiled leather right arm. Leather right arm pocket. One and three. Two and four. It's not much of a difference. Battered fedora. Don't need that guy. 
Don't need to. Gonna hang on to one of them though. Winter jacket. All right, 203, 280. Now, we wanna see these weapons here. Scoped Institute rifle. So 17, fire rate 66, big range. Very curious what it looks like though. Wow, so this could be my a, a new sniper. Look at this thing. It takes up the whole fucking screen, man. Not bad. Let's get into the light. Have a look. There it is. That's like a lucky stormtrooper's dick. Okay, so of course it's fucked up. If you're new, the reason the scope is fucked up, it's because of the widescreen thing. That's Bethesda needs to fix that shit or the mod community will do it for them, which is more likely to happen. Laser rifle versus, see, I want to rename all this stuff so it's in the same, so it's easier to compare. I've got the Institute Pistol, 15, Laser Rifle 26. I don't know, I think it's by far a better weapon. But Scoped Institute Rifle is pretty badass. Alright, let's assign it to something. That's my Sniper. Bolt action. No, I want to keep that. Yeah, I don't use this gun. I don't know why I have this tactical pipe pistol. All right, so let's put the, let's do this. Let's not be stupid here. I want to keep it simple. So that'll go two. Ah, shit. And then the scope is going to go three. Q, three, good. How's my health? I should probably take something, right? N, what's that do? Because data. Aid. Okay, bloat fly meat. No. Sort. Scroll up. Pretty much just assuming that that's where the stuff that's useful is. If you sort by value. Ribeye steak. 110. That'll probably heal me way more. Yeah, 203 to 280. I gotta get 70. That's about right. Although, does that radiation cut that out? That's okay. All right, guys, there you are for that video. Thanks for finding the channel. I'm going to go catch up with Ted Danson. We're going to keep pushing through. We'll see what these laser weapons are like. I'm pretty excited about them. And uh, you're going to uh, join me for that in the next video. Like and subscribe if you're enjoying our playthrough. And comment and share. Oh, check out our Facebook, too. There's a link in the description. Start liking on that. I don't know how to use Facebook to promote, but eventually we're going to have a big audience on YouTube, and that means a big audience on Twitter and a big audience on Facebook, which are all just ways of keeping people updated about our uh, our goings-ons here at the Suck Professor Network of Independent Programming. Good night, good luck, and go fuck yourself.